What's up, YouTube? This is Herb Vernacular TV. If you like this content, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Today, I want to have a discussion about hip hop, Black Lives Matter, and the hypocrisy. The conversation is basically on a general surface level. I want to critique hip hop in the sense that through the lens of hip hop, how is black lives matter? You know, how is it portrayed? In the world of hip hop, how is black lives matter on, on, on portrayal? So today I will critique hip hop, black lives matter and it's hypocrisy. Hip hop, the music of the ghetto, but now it just filled with foulness and decadence. Violence, drug usage, fake bravado, cloud chasing, the worshiping of things, material, cars, clothes. Watches, a facade, chasing that facade. But hip hop, to the lens of hip hop, the black life matter. All these rappers have been dying, getting killed. The King Von, the 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 Mo Three, the Nipsey Hustle. All these rappers just losing their life. Pop Smoke. All these rappers just losing their life. The, does Black Lives Matter through the lens of hip hop? Hip hop is there a diplomatic avenue that being explored here as far as to deal with the the imagery that is being portrayed to the world, the imagery that is being given on Black Lives Matter, of black people in in in, in the up and on in the world of hip hop for all these black lives that is being lost. In contrast. When the state commit a crime or alleged crime against a black person, everybody's up in arm. Everybody's up in arm. Yes, that the state is there to protect our interests so it shouldn't be abusing us. That's why everybody's up in arm. But at the same token, when they take extra judicial killings, like the Mike Brown, the 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 Eric Gardner, those, those, those people who have loved, lost their lives to extrajudicial killings, we are up in arms, rightfully so, we should be, because we want to make Black Lives Matter. But the imagery that we portray, the imagery, you know, that hip hop gave off, you know, of black people, the way black men are dying so rapid, no general music, that people die like that, that their bodies on the line. So, does Black Lives Matter to, you know, you know what I mean, to hip hop? Does Black Lives Matter in our community? When people who are terrorizing the community, we are advocating for them. You know, free this guy, free that guy. When he had murdered somebody, when he had committed such a crime. Does Black Lives Matter? We are up in arm when, it, when it's the state. When it's an extrajudicial killing of the state, you know, police violence. You know, we are up in arm, rightfully so we should be. Cause we are the people. So, you know, we should be free in this regard. We should protest against any oppression, any abuse of one's human rights. But does Black Lives Matter in, 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 in the imagery that hip hop produces? The rapid killing, the violent, the abuse, the drug usage, you know, black men just leaving this leaving this earth like it's nothing, just dying carelessly, carelessly in these American societies, hairless in this capitalist society, just dying, tra chasing material things that they can't gain. The Black Lives Matter in our community when we advocating in for murderers to come home. You know, Black Lives Matter is a sentiment. You gotta understand that it's a sentiment. If your life matter, you have to have the willingness 
to make it matter. They said, well, I will. You got to make your life matter. These organizations out here, these activism out here, they all gain money on black people suffering, black people behalf. If your life matter, you got to make yourself matter. You got to want it for yourself. You got to pick yourself up. You know? So when I see these rappers, uh, uh, these rappers, when they're in their, in their mid-30s now, and they're advocating, you know, pressing reform and all these different things like that, it's cute. Because your whole career, you went, you went promoting drug users to killing, promoting and killing a black man. Violence, abuse of women, drug using, material, material worship. You understand? Material worshiping things. Now in your mid-30s, now you not you not sow all those bad seeds. These young black brothers have followed your footsteps. Some of them have been incarcerated because of your lyrics. But now you want to advocate, you know, prison reform. You have sent a whole bunch of people to prison. Black Lives Matter is a sentiment in the heart. You have to have the willingness. This American capitalist society ain't going to do nothing for you. It's survival of the fittest. You got to compete. You got you, you, you to gotta work towards what you want. You know, there is going to be obstacle because that's life. But you got to want it. Black Lives Matter is in the heart. It should be a sentiment. Does it matter in hip hop? Does it matter in our community? Or it does it only matter when you know when the state is perpetuating the violence against us? Rightfully so, we should be up against that. Up against that because that's the historical backdrop. But Black Lives Matter should matter in your community. It should reflect in hip hop. Does Black Lives Matter?